residents to get insight on their experiences this winter. Lex. Beth, with most Anchorage residents currently having properly cleared residential areas, some are still seeing drastic impacts of a lack of plowing in their neighborhoods. That can include things such as one-lane roads, large snow berms, and icy ruts. The Bronson administration has pointed to complications with plowing out of the gate to include the city having to cover for the state during back-to-back -back snowstorms in early November. But with the delays in plowing throughout that month, Anchorage Assembly member Zach Johnson is questioning whether the municipality is adequately resourced for dealing with major snow events, especially with the large amount of community concerns this winter. Johnson says there is a huge impact when people cannot safely or efficiently navigate through snow in the city. Susie Hawley, an Anchorage resident since 1968, who lives off of Muldoon, Muldoon Road, says she believes driving is more dangerous in her neighborhood versus many others. She also says there have been several complaints from her neighbors on the current width of their road, which currently barely allows two cars to squeeze by next to each other. This year, the roads do not seem to be flat. It's kind of like you're constantly going over humps and bumps, and it can kind of throw your tires cattywonk, and you just ha really have to make sure you're holding on to the steering wheel to make sure you're going to stay focused on the lane. I think Jill gained a better understanding of, of what happened. Um, you know, a lot of people were concerned about uh, how long it took for streets to get plowed, the, the quality of the street plowing, sidewalks, etc. Um, and this really was, you know, an extraordinary snow event. So it, it was, you know, we, we recognized it was going to be a challenge to deal with it. Uh, but I think we have some questions about, you know, is this really the best we could have done under the circumstances? The assembly and administration will be reviewing the municipality's snow removal response on Wednesday at an Enterprise and Utilities Oversight Committee special meeting. It will take place in Suite 155 at City Hall from 12.40 p.m. to 2.10 p.m. The meeting will also feature speech speakers from the MOA and Alaska DOT MPF to speak on the snow removal response so far this winter.